Hi, today I'll be reviewing this Star Wars playing cards deck. Um, it's the size of about a normal normal set of cards. You got, um, can I fit in my hand? It's about two and a half by three and a half by like one inch wide. Um, if you look at the design on the front, it's got like an X wing right there, Y wing right there, two lightsabers on the side, and then the intergalactic empire, or well, the galactic empire, and then the rebel alliance signs right here. The middle is like a cockpit looking out on the stars, which is pretty cool. And um, the there are some lines that are accented and pop out a little bit just for the design on the front. So if I run my finger along this, I can feel those lines, which is pretty cool. Um, looking on the sides, it says, may the force be with you. Then if we look on the back, it's got like R2-D2 and, you know, going into hyperspace kind of look. And then it has the um, the Republic, the Galactic Republic signs right here and right here. Again, two lightsabers. And then the Galactic Republic sign, or the Galactic Empire sign in the middle with the Rebel Alliance signs right here. It's got like little X-Wings right there. And it has some uh, Star Wars language kind of um, engravings, or not engravings, writings right there. Again, the design kind of pops. And then if you look, there's another quote on the side. Luminous beings are we, said by Yoda. If you look on the top, it says do or do not, there is no try, also by Yoda. And then on the bottom, it says Disney Premium Playing Cards. So nothing uh, nothing too exciting on the bottom. If we open the top, it has this cool little quote thing. It says stay on target. It's a Y-wing with two X-wings right there, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then on the little folds of the cards, there's two uh, X-wings right there. It pivots back like this, which allows you to grab the back of the cards, open it like so. So it's got this uh, random card right here. Don't need to worry about that. But this is what the backs of the cards look like, which is the same as this back right here. And so it's just your standard deck comes with all the cards. But the cool thing is um, there's familiar characters on the deck itself. Like for the queen, there's Queen Amidala. And then for this Ace of Spades, there's um, Yoda raising the X-Wing from the Swamp and Dagobah. And then the um, number cards are pretty basic, but when you get to like the Kings and stuff, like there's, um, there's a Jedi, and then you have Mon Mothma. And as you can see, there's familiar characters on all of the face cards. Like you got some Sith ones right there. And even the Aces have stuff on them. So as far as cards go, these are pretty cool because you'll be able to see the familiar characters and the familiar the familiar faces of the Star Wars series, which is really cool. And it does go into the um, newer trilogy, so it covers all nine movies, which is pretty boss. Again, random card that you don't need. And then the two Jokers are droids. So that's pretty boss. As far as the cards quality go, they are basically just a normal set of cards. They look, they just look pretty cool. So you, you know, if you want them to last a while, be careful with them, but they are still pretty thin. So they allow you to shuffle well, especially if you like, you know, bridging and stuff like that. I would highly recommend getting these cards, especially if you are a Star Wars fan like me, because it is just a cool way to show how into Star Wars you are and just to see the familiar faces on the cards. I would highly recommend getting them if you have the chance.